Asta and Liebe Union Mode. Asta seems to have new devil mark. We explain why we believe Asta can be a devil hybrid. And we have new hints for a possible anti-magic zone. Black Clover 282. The chapter begins with the demon god starting his attack and Asta literally filling the gigantic mana energy ball with anti-magic, which immediately completely dissolves the mana. If you have seen our previous video, you know we were talking about the anti-magic zone where Asta could fill its surroundings with anti-magic, which would make every little mana source disappear and then Asta could control that anti-magic environment. And this counter-attack is pretty much what anti-magic zone can be. Asta used this anti-magic to fill the mana-based energy ball. So, in theory, an anti-magic zone is actually possible. Asta and Liebe were able to partially dissolve Nacht's mana zone when they went into the union mode for the first time. This was noticeable by the light from outside the mana zone it looks like the light was shining into the mana zone dark prison. If we compare it to this panel, we see that the dissolution of the shadow mana zone looks very similar to this panel here. And together with the fact that Asta was able to cancel Nacht's union mode, even though Asta intentionally missed Nacht shows that Asta full anti-magic power not only cancels mana by touching it, but also emits a certain invisible anti-magic wave, which causes everything that is nearby to dissolve. This information from the first union mode and what Asta and Liebe did with the energy mana ball made by the demon god is enough to assume that Asta, if he can learn to manifest the anti-magic around him, which by the way is very possible since Liebe can control the swords, and thus the anti-magic, then it is undeniable that Asta, theoretically, can use the anti-magic zone which completely dissolves any magic around him. And of course I'm aware that this is completely overpowered. Nobody could touch Asta. Ironically, it would have the same effect as with his mother. Everything around him will die as we know that mana is linked to life force. I mean, look what he did to the plant when he first transformed into his devil mode, which is nowhere near the union mode. And now imagine a concentrated, controlled anti-magic zone filling the entire area around Asta. Over Powered. Asta said that he got rid of the magic power of the demon god. And look at Damnatio. This is the face of a man who knows that he f***ed up. He looks like, damn it, even if I want to put this man in jail, what the hell could I possibly do against this? Okay, okay, we'll get to the panel in a moment. Damnatio is shocked and then we have a little location change back to the Spade Kingdom. Xenon versus Yuno. In the last chapter, Xenon bragged about how everyone is being defeated by the demon god in the Clover Kingdom, but Yuno keeps it cool, knowing that Asta is in the Clover Kingdom and will defeat the demon god. Asta, Liebe, Union Mode. I'm not sure if there's an official name already, but for now, let's go to the comments and give me a cool name for this transformation. I will mention some comments in the next video. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And thank you for all the new subs, we growing crazy fast. Let's continue. We can see that Asta and Liebe Union Mode looks amazing. And the most important part here are two things. First, for the anti-magic zone theory, we see what looks like concentrated anti-magic balls surrounding Asta. These remind me a little bit of Yami's death thrust and I could imagine Asta if he learns to control those balls can probably use them for fighting. Basically these anti-magic balls could prove that Asta can manifest anti-magic around him and thus make an anti-magic zone. Of course, only if this is really anti-magic, I mean, what else could this be? The second important thing we can see is that Asta has two devil marks. This is absolutely insane information and no, Asta is not a shark, even if his teeth lead you to believe it and he looks like he can breathe underwater. I can't wait for someone to publish a theory that Asta is a shark, that will be too funny. Anyways, these markings actually look like devil marks. Nacht had similar marks when used the Cat Devil Union. Also, the two additional horns are not part of Liebe. Those of you who remember our theory about the similarities between Yuki Tabata's first manga Hungry Joker and Black Clover will know that we made a theory that Asta is a devil hybrid, just like the main character in Hungry Joker. 
they don't really call it devil, but the principle is the same, it doesn't matter. The point of this video was that Tabata's first manga was cancelled way too early, before he could actually introduce the real plot. So he basically continued the plot of Hungry Joker in his new manga Black Clover. And it has really many similarities. And now we see that Asta has these two marks, which I can't explain other than that these are devil marks and the two horns could either be a sign of forbidden magic from the underworld or simply devil horns. Now if we imagine that Asta is really a devil hybrid, however the f that happened, <laughs> it's up to her. Then we know that hybrids usually don't know they are hybrids, unless they turn into their hybrid form for some reason. Charmy did it in the fight against Elfril. And now with the union mode, it is maybe possible for Asta to activate his devil hybrid. Devils definitely have their own marks, like Liebe, Zagrid, and even Lilith and Ama. It is reasonable to say that these are signs of a devil, but where do they come from? I doubt Asta is possessed by a second devil, so... Asta must be a devil himself. How else can we explain these signs? The horns are a whole different thing as the Doctorite have horns too and maybe it's because they somehow turn into devils too. Maybe that's a part of the deal with Lucifero. The horns are definitely an important secret that has yet to be revealed. But if Asta is really a devil hybrid, he should be able to use some type of magic as each part have its own magic. In Asta's case, human and devil part. If Asta's human part has no mana, maybe his devil part has some kind of magic and mana. In Hungry Joker, the main character has gravitation magic and he's a devil hybrid. If you know our theory about Asta and the gravitation magic, you know we think it's possible that Asta's devil part could have gravitation magic because of Hungry Joker. Which will definitely explain the strange similarity between Asta and Dante's marks on the forehead. Asta then wants to attack the demon god and asks Damnatia to watch him as he wants to protect the Clover Kingdom with his devil power. And the citizens of the Clover Kingdom are obviously confused and scared, not knowing if Asta has come to help the demon or to protect the kingdom. But those who know Asta know that he is here to protect everyone. And it is so nice to see how everyone believes in Asta and how everyone has all their trust in him. Anyone who looks up to Asta knows he is the only hope the Clover Kingdom has to defeat the demon god right now. Then Asta begins his attack and basically wipes out the demon god completely with his black divider. It is interesting that Asta did not cut the demon with the solid part of his sword, but with the anti-magic. It almost seems as if he will destroy the mana and thus the life force and cells when he touches the demon. At this point Asta is completely overpowered, but he can only hold this union mode for 5 minutes. So even if he only fought for a minute. He still has 4 minutes left and it seems like he wants to finish the entire spade war in just 4 minutes. Gimodelo seems to have noticed that Nacht is about to die, so Asta asks Gimodelo to take him to the spade kingdom. I mean, I understand, I see that Asta is overpowered. There is no way the devils can win against him, unless they are much stronger than it seems so far. But the only way I can see how this war will go on is that either the devils are really stronger and the dark triad is on a comparable level with Asta as they also have 100% or in the case of that Asta is stronger, Morris will simply open the next layers, releasing the next devils who could be then as strong as Asta or maybe even stronger. That's it for today, I hope you enjoyed and if you did, please leave a like and if you are new, subscribe to our channel with notification bell on, otherwise YouTube will not notify you if we upload a new video. Thanks for watching and don't forget to comment. Bye.